everyone, so for today's video I'm going to be doing a IKEA homeware haul and just other random like little bits haul. I'm sorry this is another haul but I did I sat down to do my homework and I realised that I didn't have a video for today so I am filming a haul because I don't have enough time to film like a really good video so I just thought I'd do a haul and plus I absolutely love these videos because they really help me with like room decor inspiration but if you want to know what I got from Ikea then keep on watching so I accidentally took home the Ikea bag and I'm not sure if you're supposed to take these home my mum said that you're not but I I don't know I didn't realize until we were home um so yeah sorry okay so the first thing I got is this skewer candle dish and I've wanted one of these for so long and it's so cute and it turns my lighting a bit weird but it just has this really pretty floral um I don't it kind of reminds me of lace like around the outside um but I absolutely love the skewer collection from IKEA I don't actually have anything from there but now I do and I've wanted this for ages and I absolutely love it. I don't actually know what I'm going to do with this but I will find a use for it. And this was £1.50. So the next thing I got is this Rotera. I think that's what it's called. It's all in Sweden. Or is it Sweden? Yeah, it's all in Swedish. So I can't read what it says but this is just this really cute um, candle lantern that quite a lot of people have and it just has this really cute little star detail around and this sends my lighting really weird as well most of these things will send my lighting weird because most of them are white um but i just love this and it just has this little thing that you lift it up and it opens and it's really cute i didn't know what i'm gonna do with this either but i think i might put a candle in it obviously because it's a candle lantern i think i might just like put it on my side or something and i think this is really cute so i got this this was two pounds so the next thing I got, or things I got, was three pounds, and it is these dro milk, milk, something like that. But it's just this name here, and it is these rose candle dishes, and these are so cute, and they actually smell really fresh. So I like that, and it's just really, it's just like a baby pink wax. You can see my hyphen, <laughs> and it's just this really pretty design, and I absolutely love these. I think I might put one of these on the candle dish because I think that might look really cute like on my bedside cabinet or something but yeah I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do with these either I'm not really sure what, why I got what I'm going to do with all these things but I just really wanted to get them because I thought they were all so cute and I love these and like I said before these were three pounds the next thing I got from Ikea was this wait I've got the name on the receipt this Pocal mug and this was one pound seventy and this is so cute. It's this really nice baby, baby? I was gonna say baby pink. It's just this really cute baby pink color and it is, oh, it's adorable, I love it. I don't know why, but I could imagine someone drinking milk out of this. I don't like milk, so I will not be drinking milk out of it, but I'm not sure whether I'm gonna use this for room decor or to drink out of, but I just absolutely love it and it's so cute and Yes, and so this was £1.70. The next things I got were these two skewer pots. Um, I wanted some of these for ages. One to store some makeup brushes in, and I don't know what the other one is for. Um, but these were... These were one ninety each. So these totaled to... I don't know how much, but I got two, and they were one ninety each. And these are just these the same kind of pattern as before um, and I think I'm gonna put all my makeup brushes in one of these and I just think they are so cute and they're adorable well cute and adorable mean the same thing but whatever and they're just oh, they're gorgeous and they give me like an echoey sound <laughs> and most people do store the makeup brushes in these so I wanted to join the crew and do it and be so original um, but yeah I got these so in my room I have three cactuses and a fake plant and some fake flowers and then like a flower wallpaper and like some flower fairy lights and stuff like that 
So I wanted to get a fake plant that is a bit lopsided um, just because I think these are so cute and they just add a really nice pop of colour to your room and I'm thinking I might put one of the put this in one of my skewer pots just because this looks really cute and kind of put this on my window ledge. I actually got the inspiration to get the to get these two things from Floral Princess or Anastasia, you probably know who she is. I got this, I think they're the best quality one. Um just because I was in a rush and I couldn't be bothered looking through all of them. But I just got this one and I thought I could just kind of mess around with it and get it how I wanted. This was three pounds. Um, so yeah, I got this and this is the last thing I got from Ikea. So all the things I got from Ikea totaled to £13.10p. So that is really good because I got a lot of things and I just love them all. So Ikea is really cheap. I love Ikea. I don't actually go that often um, just because I don't know and it's, I don't know why I don't go but it's really big so I kind of always get lost. So yeah, that's everything I got from Ikea. Next things were gifts from my mum's friend when she came to visit us yesterday and she got me three things and the first one is this coconut luxury fragranced room spray and this just looks like this. And I have like a little, um, it's not like a tin, well yeah, it's like a tin, but it's, it's like open and I have like a star in there, which was actually a Christmas decoration, but um, I keep it up because I think it's really cute. And I just have loads of like white things in there and I put this in it and it looks really cute. Um, this kind of smells like really fresh. Um, it isn't, well it's a nice scent but it's not kind of the type of scent I would reach for, but it is still nice. So my mum's friend knows I like to have my room always smelling really nice and last time we saw her um, she got me this jasmine ro rose, not rose, this jasmine reed diffuser kind of thing, I keep going like that, um, and mine's about to run out so she got me this air wick essential oils, mulled wine and cracking fire reed diffuser this is actually one of the christmas ones but it smells it has like a little scratch and sniff it just smells like christmas and even though it isn't christmas which makes me sad um i'm still gonna use this i might save it until christmas but i don't know so i got she got me this and it smells amazing i'm not sure whether i'm gonna use this or save it till christmas but nevertheless it still smells amazing and christmassy and it's so cute and I think this will look really nice in my room because it's like red and it'll look quite nice at Christmas which isn't until like a year um, because of like the red will match with all my Christmas decorations. So the final thing she got me is this um, like vintage kind of jar thing and it just looks like this and it's rigid and it just has this little handle and in here I just have loads of cotton pads um, to use in my Garnier micellar water and it looks really cute on my dressing table and ah, I just really really love this I think it will look really nice on top of like my Muji drawers um, actually I will be doing a what's in my Muji drawers hopefully quite soon so look out for that so the final two things are not homeware but these were from my mum when we went shopping well not shopping when we went out yesterday I think it was and these are two L'Oreal products and the first thing is this L'Oreal foundation, it's the L'Oreal 2 Max foundation, I don't know why I'm reading out all of it, but this is in the shade Rose Ivory, which is C1, I'm not sure if it'll focus on it just because it's really reflective. And this is SPF 17 and it says it matches skin colour and texture and I use this today. Um, it has really good coverage but not necessarily on my nose because that's where my problem area is with like my spots and stuff um, and I didn't cover that very well I think it's just because the surface of my nose is really bumpy and horrible but this gave me a really good overall coverage all over my face and I really loved this and this was 9 99 The final thing in this haul is also a L'Oreal product because the boots that I went into was having a offer where all L'Oreal products um, you could get two for £14, so I got the L'Oreal Mega Volume Miss Manga Mascara. 
and so I practically got this for four pounds and it's just I haven't used it but the packaging is so cute and everyone raves about this so I just thought I would try it out and last thing I got a tripod and my phone's on it right now so it's got this cool thing that like wiggles it up and down sorry I'm probably not in the same place as before just because I moved it then but yeah but that's everything that I got I hope you guys did enjoy this video and thumbs up this video if you liked it and subscribe for more videos from me I don't know how many times I said the video then but I said it quite a lot but last night I actually made um, a big Muji order so hopefully soon I will do a what's in my Muji drawer because I do have some um, well not they're not a Muji ones they're just acrylic ones I got for Christmas but I've ordered like a set of the two like drawers um, so I ordered one of those and I ordered six drawer separators so hopefully soon I'll be able to do a what's in my Muji drawers um, but I don't want to do a full makeup collection until I really have the storage how I want it so subscribe to see that um, yeah so I'm really excited to do that video and I'm really excited to do a makeup collection once I've got it all how I want it because I'm happy with all the makeup I'm just not happy with the storage so when I get my Muji separators then maybe a bit after that I'll be able to do it and this jumper's gone really puffy so I hope you guys did enjoy this video and thank you for watching bye